What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. Okay, so we're finally here. It's the Elite Four time, and uh, yeah, we are qualified to go in and uh, take over Sinnoh. That's right. That's what it says on my header right there, you know, conquering the whole Pokemon world, that kind of stuff. I don't know. He's just looking at my badges right now. Don't worry, guys. I got every single one of my badges. And look, you can hear this, the song. Yes. Hell yeah. All right, bring on the first contestant. Or bring on the first victim. That's right. Who's the first one? I don't even know. But yes, off screen. Slight training. Changed up a few moves here and there. Just for this occasion. And, uh, well... It's been a long time coming, guys, but it's finally here. We're going to be battling in the Elite Four. And uh, our first trainer happens to be a Grass-type or Bug-type trainer. No, yeah, he is a Bug-type trainer. So, here it is. Welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Aaron of the Elite Four. And a uh, huge fan of Bug-type Pokemon. Nasty, mean, yada, yada, yada. Challenges here. Bring it on. Okay. So, here it is, guys. Our very first battle against Aaron of the Elite Four, the Bug-type trainer. We already know how to defeat Bug-type uh, Pokemon. You got Fire-types, Flying-types, uh, even Rock-types. Hell, I think Steel-types can do it, right? I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. Ice-types? Because they're essentially, you know, plants. Of some sorts. I don't even know. But there you go. Flamethrower. Just destroy Young Mega right there. Look at that. No chance whatsoever. Bye bye Young Mega. Ooh. And uh, here he comes out with a hair cross. So let's see. I'm just gonna stay with, or you know what? I'm gonna switch it out to, I'm gonna switch it out to Starblade right here because, yeah, I don't want to risk getting my butt kicked by a flying or a fighting slash bug type Pokemon. I don't. And so here it is. I'm intimidating you. And uh, yeah, try and hit me. Let's go. Fly attack. Let's go. Try and hit me with something. It's gonna do Stone Edge, but that doesn't work out right now. And here it is, fly attack for the win. Oh yeah. Bye bye. Say bye bye to Heracross, everybody. It's a pretty cool Pokemon. I've always wanted to use a Heracross on my team at some point. I think I did in my original Pokemon Crystal walkthrough. If you guys all remember. Yeah, that didn't really like. I didn't really plan that out correctly because, of course, uh, in Generation Two, Heracross is not that great. And here comes Drapion. This is a scary Pokemon right here. Because it knows this. A lot of poison type moves. And, uh, yeah, it can poison you. Just like that. Scary. So here we go. Flamethrower. Let's get that. Oh, yes. Flamethrower. Oh, yes. Takes half of that. I'm getting hurt by poison, but it's okay. I'm going to finish you off by switching to another Pokemon because. Yeah, I don't want none of that. I, uh, Drapion is a, again, it's a scary Pokemon just because it is a unique uh, poison slash bug type. If, if, if it even is a bug type Pokemon, and it is very strong when it comes to like some of these moves. So there we go, Earthquake Attack. That's right. No chance. Should have used that move instead. There we go. And, uh, well, let's see. Everybody's getting experience points, and of course, Toothless too. And he's going to be coming out with a Scizor. Okay, so let's go back to Hera. Of course, it's still poisoned. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to risk it. It is very strong on defense, guys. But it's slow. It's not as fast as it used to be when it was a, was a, when it was a side third. So here we go. Flamethrower. Quadruple damage. Yeah. That's right. Melt, you dumbass Scizor. Or Scizor, or whatever you like to call it. Yeah. Okay, alrighty. So everybody's winning, and of course, Hera still getting hurt by poison. And, uh, well, I think you've done enough, Hera. So, oh, you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna risk it. Let's go again, and let's take on Vespiqueen right here. Vespiqueen is a powerful Pokemon as well. Applies pressure to any kind of move that you have. But as you can see, it is also a bug type Pokemon, so, uh, ha ha ha. Take that, Vespiqueen. Hera wins. Fatality. And that is how you deal with Aaron right here. He concedes to be bug type Pokemon, yada yada yada. Oh yeah, it is a, a complex affair. Yes. Okay, so that is one down. Now we got another three or four more to go. So I'm going to heal up off screen, guys. Stay tuned. In the next episode, we will be going into the next room. See you guys.